Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel T-Spot. In this video, an episode of Sanditon with Charlotte and Colborn in it. Since the beginning of season 3, we've been waiting for an episode like this, and we got it. Before episode 5, Charlotte and Alexander could only spend brief amounts of time together in the company of other people. However, this time they were by themselves and unaffected. Furthermore, we realized their time together would change something in the two of them. It did too. Finally, Charlotte was brave enough to end her relationship with Ralph. Let's take a closer look at how that came to be. Charlotte set out with Alexander to find Augusta and Edward at the beginning of the episode. Prior to that, Alexander was informed by Leo that Augusta and Edward intended to travel to Falmouth. Therefore, Charlotte and Alexander went there on an all-night excursion to determine where Edward and Charlotte might be staying. Of course, they talked a lot during this journey. Alexander was enraged at himself because he believed he could have stopped Augusta from fleeing because she was unable to think for herself. Charlotte, on the other hand, refuted that sentiment, stating that girls don't need to be safe from themselves and that often it is a father or brother who thinks for them. Whether Edward was the one is irrelevant. Augusta wanted to be with him because she was in love. She should not be forced into a loveless marriage by Alexander. We were aware that Alexander was greatly influenced by Charlotte, but we were unaware of how much. Alexander was ready to let Augusta make her own decision when they discovered Edward and Augusta. He said, assuming Augusta accepted Edward was appropriate for her, he wouldn't hold them up. After just one trip with Charlotte, the man becomes a feminist. We were truly moved by his respect for Charlotte and her viewpoints. He was prepared to give Edward access to the family, assuming that it was Augusta's decision. However, that was not the case. Edward peculiarly woke up and made an unusual admission. He said he just needed Augusta for her legacy. He became even more cruel as Augusta tried to deny that. Did she feel that it could be her who might recover Edward Denham? Yes, we were astonished as we watched that scene. In all three seasons of Sanditon, Edward Denham succeeded once more. He thought about someone other than himself for the first time in his life. It turns out that he cared a lot about Augusta. Otherwise, he wouldn't have been so close to marrying her to tell her everything. We could see that he was really upset when he went back to Sanditon and talked to Lady Denham. He did this since he accepted Augusta merited somebody better, somebody with a superior standing and a superior name. There is, after all, always a first time. We accepted Edward couldn't change, however this episode made us reconsider our viewpoint on him. After all, he might still be kind-hearted. Although this journey greatly assisted Charlotte and Alexander, Augusta was heartbroken. When Alexander first met Augusta at the inn, he told her how amazing she was as a young woman and asked her if she thought Edward was worthy of her. We thought he was talking to Charlotte here. He inquired as to why Charlotte would believe Ralph to be the best option for her. In any case, he likewise comprehended that Charlotte was with Ralph as a result of her folks' choice, not on the grounds that she was enamored with the man. However, Charlotte also realized that a loveless marriage was not the best use of one's time. She realized that she should be with the person she loves, especially when she saw Tom crying over Mary on her sickbed. She spoke with Ralph at the episode's conclusion. We thought Ralph would start the breakup, but Charlotte ended up doing it. Despite this, he came to the realization that Charlotte had fallen in love with Mr. Colborn and that she had never intended to wed him. Even though Ralph was heartbroken to hear the news, she eventually stated that she could not marry Ralph. Despite the fact that this marriage was arranged, it appears that he loved her. We just expectation Charlotte didn't drag him for such a long time, however, basically it's over at this point. In the show's final episode next week, we might finally get to see her marry Alexander. In this episode, what did you think about Edward? What will befall Charlotte and Alexander in the following episode? Let us know what you think in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.